So I thought we would have some of our comedians by this time. I know Christy said that she was going to be here, but she was going to be here late. I thought June would be here. But instead, you get Ski. So put your hands together for Ski. Um, so the Renaissance Fair is in town. I went this last weekend. Woo! I love the Renaissance Fair. Woo! A long time ago, I used to play in the SCA, the Society for Creative Anachronisms, which are one of the groups that put on uh, the Ren Fair. Um, we were dressed in fun clothes, and we'd speak in my loans and my ladies. And we had great stories and awesome art, calligraphy, illumination, people doing spinning and weaving, all kinds of great stuff. Um, and I was a bard. I'd go from campfire to campfire um, with the drums in the background when I'd sing songs. And I was at a, a, a big event called Pensick, where two great kids come together and fight, and the loser gets Pennsylvania. <laughs> uh, uh, <laughs> and it was an amazing night, and it was just incredible. Campfires, smoke in the air, everyone walking around and drinking and having fun. And off in the distance, the, the drums and dancing girls. And I sat down at this one campfire, and uh, there was another part of the campfire, and he sang a song. And this is the song I went and I chased it down and uh, learned it from him. For we are the worms of the earth Against the lions of might All of our days we are tied to the land While they hunt and they feast and they fight We give them our crops and our homes and our lives and the clerics tell us this is right. Well, they've beat us before, and they'll beat us again. But we'll drink from their helmets tonight. My father worked on the land, as did his father before him, sowing and planting by hand, and harvesting what the land bore him. It was murdered by bandits before I was ten. One stroke on the sword, and then they were gone. My lord strutted bravely atop his tall wall. I did nothing to hinder the slaughter. For we are the worms of the earth against the lions of might. All of our days we are tied to the land, where they hunt and they feast and they fight. We give them our crops, and our homes, and our lives, and the clerics tell us this is right. They've beat us before, and they'll beat us again, but we'll drink from their helmets tonight. Our Lord went to fight in the war, mounted atop a tall stallion, to fight for some noble cause, with his guards and his henchmen to guard him. We heard he'd been captured with all of his men. For that, they were raising our taxes again. To pay the huge ransom in gold and in gems. To bring our world back to rule us. For we are worms of the earth. Against the lions of might. All of our days we are tied to the land. Or they hunt and they feast and they fight. We give them our crops and our homes and our lives, and the clerics tell us this is right. Or they beat us before, and they'll beat us again, but we'll drink from their helmets tonight. This year we had a great drought. Our crops were burned in the field. Not that our Lord did without, for his men took all they could steal. When our Lord came amongst us with some of his men to announce that they are raising our taxes again, a few of us acted on our desperate plan, and his body was meat for the crows. For we are the worms of the earth, against the lions of might. All of our days we are tied to the land, where they hunt and they feast and they fight. We give them our crops and our homes and our lives, and the clerics tell us this is right. They've beat us before, and they'll beat us again, but we'll drink from their helmets tonight. We stare into the fire, behind our poor barricade, 
Too tired to fight the despair, knowing no one will come to our aid. At first light tomorrow, the knights gather round, gather in force, and they'll hunt us all down. And I'll bear our heads proudly on pikes to the town. And I'll find that we'll be paid. For we are the worms of the earth against the lions of might. All of our days we are tied to the land, or they hunt and they beast and they fight. We give them our crops and our homes and our lives, and the clerics tell us this is right. Well, they beat us before, and they'll kill us tomorrow. We'll drink from their helmets tonight. Um, so, that's a fun song, but uh, it's kind of gloomy. In case you didn't notice, you know. Little. Just a little. Um, Not really. So, um, this is another really gloomy song. Um, uh, it's called Scotsman. All Scotsmen clad in kill, left the bar while evening fair. And one could tell by how he walked that he drank more than his hair. He stumbled around until he could no longer keep his feet. Then he stumbled off into the grass to sleep beside the stream. Ring ding diddle diddle I dee oh, ring di diddle I ho. He stumbled off into the grass to sleep beside the street. About that time two young and lovely girls just happened by. One says to the other with a twinkle in her eye, See young sleeping Scotsman so strong and handsome built. I wonder if it's true when they don't wear beneath their kills. <laughs> ring ding diddle little by the o, ring di to the I o. I wonder if it's true when they don't wear beneath their kills. They crept up on that sleeping Scotsman quiet as could be. Lifted up his killed about it so they could see. And there the old for them to view beneath the Scottish skirt was nothing more than God and graced him with upon his birth. <laughs> ring ding diddle little I yo, ring di diddle I yo, was nothing more than God and graced him with upon his birth. They marveled for a moment, then when said we must be gone, let's leave a present for our friend before they move along. As a gift they lift a blue silk ribbon tied into a bow Around the bloody star the Scotsman's kilt did lift and show <laughs> Ring ding the little eye yo, ring di 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 o Around the bloody star the Scotsman's kilt did lift and show Now the Scotsman woke to nature's call and stumbled toward the trees Behind the bush he lifts his kilt and gawks at what he sees And in the drunken voice he says to what's before his eyes oh, Lad, I don't know where you've been, but I see you on first prize. <laughs> ring, ring, the little eye, yo, ring, that to the aisle. Oh, lad, I don't know where you've been, but I see you on first prize. Our Scottish friends still clan killed continued down the street. He hadn't gone ten yards or more when a girl he chanced to meet. She said, I've heard what's under there, oh, tell me, is it so? He said, just let your hand up, miss, if you'd really like to know. <laughs> ring, ring, the little eye, yo, ring, that to the aisle. He said, just slip your hand up, Miss, if you'd really like to know. She slid her hand right up his kilt, and much to her surprise, a Scotsman smiled, the very strange that came into his eyes. She said, why, sir, it's gruesome, and then she heard him roar. If you slip your hand up once again, you'll find it's gruesome or <laughs> Ring, ding, the little eye, oh, ring, da, 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 oh. If you slip your hand up once again, you'll find it's gruesome or <laughs> <laughs> so there's some, uh, there's some fun Irish uh, drinking songs, <clears throat> and this will be my last song. Um, Do we get to sing with you? Uh, if you want, you can always sing with, I mean, any of these songs. That's the nice thing about Irish music, you can sing along with any, it just sounds awesome, it works great, it's a lot of fun. Um, if we all had drinks, I'd sing uh, Barley Mo, but uh, I don't think so. So, instead, um, we've done really depressing, and we've done funny, and uh, so the only thing we're missing now is somebody getting knocked up and killed. 
<laughs> but that falls back in the depressing category. So we're going to go over the last one, which is uh, just love. <laughs> it's called the Rose of Charlie. Now was rising beyond the green mountain. Now sun was declining beneath the blue sea. When I saw with my love for the pure crystal fountains, I'd stand in the beautiful veil of Trani. She was lovely and fair. As a rose of the summer, but was not her beauty alone that won me? Oh no, was the truth in her eyes ever dawning? I'd make me a Mary, the rose of Trani. smiling, sad listening to me, I go to the valley, her pale rays were shedding, when I won the heart of the most of Trani, she was lovely and fair as a rose of but was not her beauty alone that won me? Oh no, was the truth in her eyes ever dawning? I'd make me love Mary, the rose of Trani. A love song, um, a drinking song, what would you like to hear? How about a drinking song about the uh, traveling Irishman, or is it the traveling Scotsman? Um, so there's, uh, well, yeah, I know there's like a million of those. No, I know, so there's a whole series of but, uh, whiskey rub, uh, there's the Whistling Gypsy, which is a love song, where no. there's the uh, I'm a Rover, Seldom Sober, there's uh, Whiskey in the Jug. Uh, the one... <laughs> that's the one that uh, Metallica did a cover of. No. Uh, uh, no, it's the one where the guy travels all week and he comes home every weekend. Oh, Seven Drunken Nights! Yes! Oh, yes! Yes. Want to turn it back on? I didn't turn it off, because I'm smart. <laughs> Don't worry, I'm not recording this. <laughs> I mean, I'm not recording. Here. Record. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so this is an audience participation song, and as such, um, you have parts to play in this. and. Yep. We have a, a somewhat even division between uh, males and females. Evan's kind of on the fence, so we'll count him in the girls' quad. So, <laughs> oh, he's not here! Uh, it's no fun if I can't insult him if he's not here. No Bad, fun. You know? I thought you were Minnesota uh, insulting him. <laughs> so, what we're going to do is we're going to. Uh, this is how a typical day in this, uh, this fellow's life goes. I came home on Monday night to drunk as drunk could be. I saw a horse out in the yard where my own horse should be. So I called my wife and I says to her, and I need all the guys to say, Hey, wife! Can you try that? And I says to her, Hey, wife! Now I need all the ladies to say, in the most ladylike way you can, What do you want, you drunken scumbag? <laughs> Just try this. I came home on a Monday night, as drunk as drunk it could be. I saw a horse out in the yard where my own horse should be. So I called my wife and I says to her, Hey, hey wife! wife! What do you want, you drunken scumbag? <laughs> but you kindly tell to me, don't worry, don't get into it, trust me, I always do. <laughs> but you kindly tell to me, who owns this horse out in the yard where my own horse should be? Well, you're drunk, you're drunk, you silly old fool, still you cannot see. 
that's a lovely cow that me mother sent to me. Well, in that's many a day I travel a hundred miles or more, but a sow on the milk and cow sure I never saw before. And I came home on a Tuesday night as drunk as drunk could be. I saw a hat upon the rack where my own hat should be. So I called me wife and I says to her, Hey, wife! Why do you want to drive me scumbag? See, I told you, they get in it. Okay, we can feel we have a well of rage. And you kindly turned to me, who owns a hat upon the rack where my own hat should be. Well, you're drunk, you're drunk, you silly old fool, still you cannot see. That's a flower pot that me mother sent to me. Well, it's many a day I travel a hundred miles or more, but a sweat bend in the flower pot sure I never saw before. And I came home on a Wednesday night as drunk as drunk could be. I saw a pipe upon the shelf where my own pipe should be. So I called me wife and I says to her, Hey, hey wife. wife! What are you walking, dirty scumbag? As <laughs> you kindly tell to me, oh, on the shelf where my own pipe should be. Well, you drunk, you drunk, you silly old fool, still you cannot see. That's a lovely tin whistle that me mother sent to me. Well, it's many a day I travel a hundred miles or more, but tin whistles with tobacco in shall I never saw before. And I came home on a Thursday night as drunk as drunk could be. I saw I saw a boot beneath the bed where my own boot should be. So I called me wife and I says to her, Hey, wife! What do you want, you dirty scumbag? <laughs> 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 Was it kindly done to me? Oh, I'm that boot beneath the bed where my own boot should be. Well, you're drunk, you're drunk, you silly old fool, still you cannot see. That's a chamber pot that my mother sent to me. Well, it's many a day I travel, a hundred miles or more. But a chamber pot with laces on sure I never saw before. And I came home on a Friday night as drunk as drunk could be. I saw a face upon the bed where my own face should be. So I called my wife and I says to her, Hey, why? <laughs> I sense all I need energy. <laughs> Would you kindly tell to me? Who owns his face upon the bed where my own face should be? Well, you're drunk, you're drunk, you silly old fool, still you cannot see. That's a baby boy that me mother sent to me. <laughs> it's been a day I travel a hundred miles or more. But a baby boy with his whiskers on sure I never saw before. <laughs> and I came home on a Saturday night as drunk as drunk could be. I saw a man going out the door a little bit after three. So I called me wife and I says to her, Hey, wife! Come on, I'm doing this all by myself. I have an awesome falsetto, but still. <laughs> what you want, you dirty scumbag? Oh, thank you. Yeah. Woo! Yeah. Would you kindly tell to me? Oh, what's that man going out the door a little bit after three? Well, you're drunk, you're drunk, you're silly old fool, so you cannot see. That's the tax collector that the king he sent to me. Well, it's many a day I travel a hundred miles or more. But an Englishman that could last till three, sure I never saw before. And I came home on a Sunday night, as drunk as drunk could be. I saw a thing in my wife's head where my own thing should be. So I called me wife and I says to her, Hey, hey wife! What do you want? <laughs> I think you sound more drunk! <laughs> And you kindly tell to me, who's this that thing there in your hand where my own thing should be? Well, you don't, you don't, you silly fool, silly can't see. That's a lovely carrot that my mother sent to me. Well, it's many a day I travel, a hundred miles or more, but a carrot with two onions on sure I never saw before. 